What is going on everybody, Willis Gaming here. We are back again with another Division 2 video. In this video guys, I'll be showing you a pretty insane rifle build. Um, this build works extremely well in PvE and PvP. Um, if you haven't done so already guys, make sure you are subscribed to the channel with bell notifications turned on. Um, I post daily looter shooter videos, so this is definitely the place to be. The winner from last video's Division 2 giveaway will be on screen right now. If you'd like a chance at winning a copy of the game, I give away a copy every single video. This isn't required, but feel free to leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe to the channel. Now, with that being said, let's begin. So, a rifle build. I did a rifle build in the past. Um, just want to let everyone know this build is a work in progress, and I'm still adding stuff to it. Um, I'm making other builds, waiting for certain pieces to drop. Uh, but it's a pretty nice build to run in the dark zone and you do a ton of damage So let's take a look what weapon I'm using obviously you probably guessed it the military mk17 It did receive a buff, but this gun is still nuts. It does so much damage um, We've got optimist which weapon damage is increased by 3% for every 10% ammo missing from the magazine This is a insane perk you think I'd be running ranger but this, I honestly think this perk is so much more better. Um, we have Allegro, 10% increased rate of fire, and an everlasting while hosted and in the cover. This weapon regenerates two ammo every five seconds. This can be nice at times as well when you're healing. You'll just get like a magical like four bullets in your mag. Um, for the mods, I'm running 8% damage to elite scope, running 7% headshot damage, 10% accuracy on the grip, and 10% uh, accuracy on the suppressor. Now it's really good you try and stack some accuracy with this gun because overall it has a very low accuracy and the more accuracy you can get, obviously it'll bump the damage up. In PvE, I recommend running damage to elites, um, but if you go into like uh, conflict, uh, whap on like an accuracy site if you can. But honestly, I just keep, keep with the damage to elites if I'm in the dark zone. Um, for the secondary weapon, I'm using the Merciless for the holstered perk. Everybody sleeps on this gun. Um, everyone uses the chat box instead, but this brutality perk is nuts. Um, while holstered, landing a shot has a 5% chance to deal 20% damage as explosive damage. This is actually really, really good. Um, you think you use the chat box, but for like opening up a fight, this is really good. Because obviously with Chatterbox, you need to reload after getting a kill. So it's not really good when you like open a fight in the dark zone. Um, this definitely is much better in my opinion. Um, you've probably noticed by now, yes, I'm a running true patriot. Now, this was kind of a test I was doing just to see if this damage to armor is worth losing out all these stats, I guess. And like the perks you get on like a gas mask and like a holster. And honestly, I think it is. It's... Super good. 10% damage, damage to armor does crazy damage in the dark zone and like just PvP in general. And it definitely is worth running this gear set. Probably the only good gear set in the game in my opinion. Um, I've got 32% damage to elite and 4,200 health. Chest piece, I'm running the Overlord Armaments Point Blank Protection Vest. I got 10% rifle damage, 7.5% total armor, 11,000 health, 8% crit hit damage and 7% weapon damage. Running unstoppable force. Um, probably the meta right now is tank builds uh, with a ton of armor uh, using unstoppable force because this is really good in just overall I guess DZ and like PvP PvE and scenarios um, It's kind of like just an overall build. It's really nice and I'm running two offensive uh, mods one with armor one with health um, Improvements to this maybe have all of these blue um, You'll see why in a minute. And I'll tell you in a few seconds. So um, holster using the uh, True Patriot, obviously for the two set bonus, so I can get that 10% damage to armor. 3.5% crit hit chance, 14,000 health, crazy. And I'm running one blue slot as well. Backpack, this is what I probably could improve on, honestly. Um, I've got the Gila Guard backpack with 5% armor, uh, 8,100 bonus armor, two skill power, 15% damage to elites, and a on the ropes, which I'm not really using. For the gloves, I'd like to improve my gloves as well. If I could get devastating on my gloves. Um, so if I could basically get Araldi Holdings with 10% accuracy, 12% rifle damage, and devastating, that would be the god roll. That's what I'm trying for right now, but right now I'm stuck with Obliterate. It's okay. It's meh. Um, maybe I could swap it out for uh, Precise as well. Precise would be really nice. So if I could maybe get like an Araldi Holdings... Uh, pair of gloves with um, rifle damage and then the precise that would be probably so much more better but yeah it's 450 as well obviously be nice if it was 500 um, knee pads I'm running the overlord uh, ornaments the Dingson protection pads 
um, for the 2 set 7.5% total armor, 8200 bonus armor and the 15% damage to elites. Really, really good pair of gloves. Mm, improvements, maybe. I think, no, I think this is pretty good. I think, yeah, definitely really good. And then for the specialization tree, I'm running sharpshooter, obviously for the increased rifle damage, the headshot damage, the stability, all the awesome picks you get. Um, it's kind of just self-explanatory. Um, I'm probably gonna put in some gameplay of the background of me using this in the dark zone and just general, I guess, PVE. And obviously in the firing range, you wanna see the DPS numbers. Um, but like I said, there's a lot of improvements I could make, obviously maxing out my armor. I could easily get like 30 or 40K more armor if I had all of this 500 and above, but just working with what we got right now. My RNG is pretty terrible. And uh, yeah, most of the good rolled gear sets are really low. Um, gear score level so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the video definitely try out this build obviously if you got any improvements leave some constructive criticism instead of just rolling your face across the keyboard how your build is 10 million times better than my build this is all just fun but i hope you guys enjoyed i will see you in my next video peace Rip. NPCs behind us because that guy aggroed a patrol. Come on. Yeah, yeah, it was just me and you. And then... No, I'm here yeah, as well. I, I was okay. killing the sniper behind us. I need res. I'm resing. I need I'm, res I'm, as well. Uh, I'm healing. I'm coming back. Oh, okay. I can get vest. You, you good? You good with us? Uh, I gotta climb up. Vest, like. This one, this one, this one, this one. I gotta climb up. Is that a player from, shooting from the side? Nah, it's a turret. Thank that, you. Was, that turret's so dead, it nearly got me. In incoming, yeah. incoming, incoming. He tried to crawl back to the door. <laughs> I'll open them later, that's cool. That's good. Are we bombing it to extraction? Or yeah, yeah. Yeah. Let's go, let's put it down. Yo, he's got a fucking drone, what the fuck? Yeah. That's annoying. Can you, can you shoot it? Wait, where's this drone? I don't see it. I don't know. Watch out. I can't see his drone. Oh, it's destroyed. Well, it's behind us. Players or just what? No. NPCs for now. Yep. Almost killed the boss. Gotta take out the boss. This guy's healing. It's like a hunter, dude. He did. Yeah. Oh, he dropped the fucking exotic. We got extract now. We got pestilence. All right. Where to? Like weird that you have to like extract it. <laughs> That's how it was in Division 1, there was imagine, like one of them that was like imagine that. Imagine like farming for hours and then like having someone steal it, that would be the worst. The fact we were in here for like 10 minutes. It happened really to Nino yesterday. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We were getting clapped, dude. It was terrible, honestly. Alright, let's put it... Oh, fuck this place. Oh, fuck, there's a big patrol here. I need help. I'm here. Fuck, the boss is here, he's got a fucking drone. Play it slow. Oh my god. Alright, I'm gonna take out the ads on the left. Yeah, I'm not gonna call this in yet until we like, you know. Yeah. That's like nice. No. Shin. Just do it back in the corner. Oh fuck, there's a landmark over there being engaged. Actually, let's do it here. Come here. 
just find a place to hide. 